What's up, everyone? Sean here from Krypton Cause Investing, back with your daily crypto update for May 6th. But let's not waste any time and hop right on in. We have a current crypto market cap of $1.194 trillion, a 24-hour trading volume, which is up to $43.6 billion. BTC dominance at 47.1% and ETH dominance at 19.3%. Come down, see what our favorite cryptos are doing. Bitcoin is below the 30,000 still, but holding strong at $29,098. Ethereum still, again, holding strong at 1910. BNB doing its thing where it's always been for weeks now in the mid 320s at 324. XRP doing the same thing in the mid 40 um, cents at 0.46. And Dogecoin as well. Those three have just been sitting at the same areas for two or three weeks now, which, like I said, isn't a bad thing. Is trading at 0.077 cents. Go ahead and hop on over to DeFi. We have a DeFi market cap of 53.314 billion. Trading volume is up 18.6% at 2.9 billion. Again, we always see these crazy swings in DeFi. We could have five billion one day, two billion the next day, four billion the next day. It's absolutely wild ride in DeFi. Our top trenders in the last 24 hours are Badger at 11.59% up, Bell up 9.30, and Keep up 2.15%. So even though volume's up significantly, we don't have any major top trenders. Let's go ahead and look at some of our news stories. So we have gold and Bitcoin are in focus. Of traders amid the banking crisis in the U.S. So again, we love seeing at least I, I use the word we. I mean myself. I love seeing gold and Bitcoin compared. I do think that Bitcoin is the digital gold, and I do think there will no doubt with our digital focus on society that Bitcoin may pass gold. Obviously, non financial advice, but I do see a day where Bitcoin passes gold as the top um, market cap for any investments in the world. I think it's only a matter of time. Gold will always have its place. It's been your number one source to barter, to trade with, going back hundreds and hundreds, if not thousands of years. So, I mean, gold will always have its place, but I do see a world where Bitcoin does start overtaking that. And again, we like to see that because all of us in crypto, we want to see a world where everyone is storing their money in Bitcoin because that's more volume coming into crypto, therefore raising the value of it. Let's go ahead to our next news article. So crypto giant Binance is reportedly facing U.S. Pro for violating Russian sanctions. Again, the U.S. Department of Justice is all over these crypto companies going after them for everything again this doesn't do crypto any favors and the thing is is that they're going after all these crypto companies with no rule set in place there's no set definition of what's a security there's no set definition from the u.s department you know of justice to of how you need to operate this or how you need to operate that so again we need clear regulation the second we have clear regulation in crypto we move past all these articles where they're saying u.s is going after this company u.s is going after that company we use we finally get institutional money flowing into crypto again we just have an overall better experience in crypto once we have clear regulations because once we have clear regulations not only will institutions but your normal citizens will have more confidence coming into crypto knowing exactly what they're getting themselves into it's not just a hypothetical of um of kind of the current situation it is now so again that's about it for the new stories again there's a lot of repeat stories going on i'm trying not to repeat myself but i do want to bring you the news every single day and definitely the crypto market every single day and as I always stated, if you have any questions you can comment down below you can dm me i love chatting crypto i will literally chat crypto all day long but that will do it for the video today. Go ahead and like and subscribe. We are approaching the 3,000 subscriber mark, which is awesome. We're only maybe 40, 50 days old. But until next time, trade safe.